meet adorable little Ronnie. And Ronnie has got more energy than any other dog here today. He's just happy energy. It's puppy play energy, even though he's about three years old. Uh, Ronnie's ID number is A5090781. And he was an owner's surrender for being too vocal, uh, which means he was barking a lot. He's about 16 pounds, and we've decided that, you know, just being with him and spending time with him, he's just got puppy energy, and he needs someone who's going to throw a ball for him, chase him around the backyard, roll around with him and play with him, uh, or a, and train him. Uh, a doggy playmate, he needs to go running, walking. I mean, this little guy, he's a, a little brown and white Parson Russell Terrier, uh, and they have a lot of energy, and uh, so he needs someone that's going to really, um, you know, stimulate him and, and you know, in, uh, in terms of challenging him intellectually, he also needs someone who's going to walk with him or run with him, hike with him, you know, and if, uh, if that, all of that's done, I'm sure this vocal, uh, quality will diminish. Yeah. Um, he, go ahead, Laura. Yeah, he, um, he really hasn't been a whole, he, he really hasn't been very vocal with me, so I think no. that it was situational. I think yeah. he, you know, he, he's not, you know, he, he, he can have some vocalization, but I don't think he's as naturally a chatty Cathy as the previous owners experienced. I think it was a lot of, they, I have a feeling that they probably left him alone a lot, and he was bored. And, uh, you know, he's a Parson Russell Terrier mix, and uh, they're really smart dogs. So, you know, this, the thing about this guy is, the, the thing that's going to be really key for this guy is socializing and training. He's, he's smart, he wants to be trained, and he doesn't even know when, that training exists. Yeah. So, I mean, honestly. No. I, and you can see now, we've been here for over two minutes, and he's, he's not vocal at all. Yeah. You know, he's happy, he's alert. I think, yeah, exactly like you're saying, he needs to be challenged intellectually. Uh, he needs to just get that energy out. He's a young dog. Yeah, so he's, he's going to make somebody a really great dog. Um, yeah. But he does need he does need the training and he does need the interaction. Um, <laughs> and uh, you know he's a really nice size. He's tall for a small dog. He's got a really nice kind of athletic build. So if you yeah, like he's... to do hikes, you know he'll yeah. be able to do those with you. He's not the kind of a dog that you take on a hike and you know halfway through you're gonna have to yeah. carry him back down the mountain. No, he's about he'll 16 lovable pounds. So. Yeah, oh, absolutely. This little guy is going to be just a fun family member. So come down and meet little Ronnie and make him your own, you know. And again, he's just a people pleaser. So uh, we think he would do really well with training and become just your closest yeah. best friend. He's, he's going to be a really great little dog once oh, he gets absolutely. That, that training down. And, yeah. Uh, he just wasn't with people that really knew what to do after they got the dog. Yeah. You know, and it's like. It's Look at some, that. He's loving it's a, that. It's some time in with him and Aww. it's going to come back you know tenfold for you yeah, so come on down and take Ronnie home with you. Uh, he's here waiting for you at the Baldwin Park Animal Care Center. Look at that tongue. 